heyday y'all an exhausted and unshaven muleteer here coming to you live from Portsmouth Virginia uh, doing a wonderful morning with the daughter of the muleteer doing some homeschooling event today so getting a little bit of rest and recovery as well needed uh, be quite fair with you folks the last couple weeks just been tremendously rough uh, close to uh, seven events over the course of nine days uh, with Harry Potter thrown in the middle of that and some large uh, private events, Valentine's Day, etc. Uh, last couple weeks was rough, trust us. When the muleteer says he's been working harder than a cat trying to bury a turd in a concrete driveway, the muleteer's been wiped. But that's a good thing because that means business is flowing, people are coming in. Well, all y'all good folks, the muleteer did just want to check in with you, let y'all know things are going quite fair. We got new things coming, more sauce as you've seen on the uh, post on Facebook recently. Uh, we got a whole couple more gallons made yesterday, and I got another 20 gallons in by the end of the weekend. Uh, once there, we are also going to be starting our larger bottling process where the new candy apple bacon habanero is going to be served in a 12.5 ounce bottle. Unfortunately, it is plastic. Glass is a little up there right now. Once that can be rectified, we will eventually go to glass, hopefully in the coming future. But to get the product out to all the good folks out there, and at a more reasonable cost and reasonable size, because the muleteer does know how well the folks do seem to care for that sweet candy apple bacon fire. Anyway, folks, uh, keep your eyes out. We're going to throw this one out here on YouTube as well, just to start snagging some more folks. We're going to start putting some new things on that channel. Hopefully by the weekend, we're going to open our new section in the channel there called the Muleteers Chef Stories or Chefs from the, or excuse me, ta Tales from the Chef's Table. Uh, this is going to be an intermixture of some of uh, the Muleteers' career, some of the things the Muleteers has seen over his time, not just relative to the culinary world, but also some of the Muleteers' background for those of you that know him well, uh, the Muleteers' uh, recovery over alcohol and drug addiction, and what it was like then, what it's like now, how those interrelate. So keep your eyes peeled. That will be coming up hopefully by the weekend, and we'll be taking care of other business along the way. Keep your eyes peeled there at the Granby Theater as well, as we have many events on the way coming. Harry Potter has been expended to um, three days this time around. Uh, with three different showings of varying ages, Sunday being the family-friendly version, um, with kids uh, mainly being the um, draw for that day. So please check us out, watch what's going on there at the uh, pages. Well, folks, the mother is going to check out now. Is just wanted to touch base and let everybody know where we were standing, getting some good rest, and within the next couple of days, we'll be pushing more stuff out. You folks take care of yourselves out there, and as always, if nobody else told you, always remember, the mother Tia loves you. Take care out there, folks.